Fruit Titan Bronx on deck. Shout out to the entire LDBC. I'm going to keep this short and sweet. Um, Where the fuck is Eddie Hearn? Has anyone saw a tweet or anything? If I'm missing something, please let me know. Where's this guy at? Any other time, he has a problem keeping his mouth shut. Normally, he's all over the place talking a whole lot of crap, man. Where is he right now? You know, this is strange. You know, Anthony Joshua actually stood for something. You know, uh, we always had his fans talking about, you know, he's a true brother and, you know, he represents his people and he's in touch with his roots in Africa. And that's that's fine. Um, but he stood for something and uh, now he's being accused of being racist. And I get online and I see everyone talking about uh, you know, what he said was racist, and I heard what he said, and it wasn't racist at all. All he wants black people to do is, well, over there is the same thing we want them to do over here. We want to be self-sufficient. You know, own our own restaurants, own our own stores. You know, uh, basically do the same things they do in Chinatown. Do the same things that they do in Little Italy. I mean, I've gone to Chinatown, and You know, I've made purchases out of there. They take my money. I've gone to Little Italy and had a meal. They take my money. You know, they don't say I can't come in there, although that's that might be what they're feeling in their heart. But that's besides the point. He wants the same thing for black people. And now he's racist. I don't get it. He didn't, you know, read off a paper and say kill Whitey. He didn't say that. But he's racist, and I'm reading the comments on Facebook and on Twitter. They're saying, oh, my God, he's going to lose endorsements. He shouldn't have said that. So let me get this straight. You want him to sacrifice his integrity as a black man for some fucking endorsements? AJ, I hope you're paying attention. Going on a little over two years. We told you this shit was going to happen. These are the same fans. Now I got there's some there's some things going on here. There's a lot of white fans in there calling you a glass chin having fraud. And I've read this glass chin having fraud. Now you're the worst fighter in the world. All of a sudden, all of a sudden, as soon as you stand up for something, you're the worst fighter in the world because of this. And all the black fans from the UK. Where are y'all? Why aren't y'all coming to his defense on Twitter, on Facebook, on Instagram, defending your brother? You guys are mighty silent, man. I don't see it. If I'm missing it, please uh, 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 educate me because I haven't seen you guys at all. So we got the white extreme fans calling AJ out of his name. Right. And then you got the black fans who are not even defending him. And you got big old master Eddie Hearn not saying a goddamn word. Now, if I'm wrong about that, please hit me up. Hit me up. Let me know that he said something. Let me know that he he told uh, his people that put money in his pocket, you know, his fans. To fall back on AJ and to leave him alone, stop talking shit about him. He didn't say anything wrong because Eddie's awfully quiet for a man that runs his mouth a lot. He's awfully quiet. Awfully quiet. Eddie Hearn, where are you? AJ, good job. But I need to know what is the relationship right now between you and Eddie Hearn? Why isn't Eddie Hearn coming to your defense? I know you stood up for yourself. You told them that, you know, if you think I'm racist, go fuck yourself. Yeah, good, good, good. But um, where's Eddie Hearn in all this? You know, and I always say, you know, a lot of times, you know, cats get their Negro wake up call. I'm not even going to call that shit with you, although that's what it is. But uh, look, man, I want to know what Eddie Hearn has to say about this. I'm real curious. Drew Titan Bronx on deck. Shout out to the entire LDBC. Move!